All right, hope you're hungry, because it is time for Foodie Friday. And if you're looking for a little taste of some good za mm -hmm. in Portland. Who isn't? Yeah. yeah. The Crown is offering a new curbside takeout option. Yeah, one of my favorite places. We have Chef Vitaly Paley this morning with us to talk more about that. Good morning, Chef. Good morning, Jenny. Good morning, Emily. Hi. I, I love The Crown so much. I love the, the fried chicken uh, pizza thing that you guys do. So tell us about your new curbside pickup look option. In, in, you know, in, in anticipation of uh, reopening at some point in the near future, we decided to fire up the ovens and really give it a go. Um, because, you know, people kind of want to be comforted these days and what is better than pizza and fried chicken. So um, we started about two weeks ago. It's been really successful. People have been really enjoying it. Uh, it's a really easy process. You call the phone number at the Crown. It's uh, 228-7224, place an order within 30 minutes, you come by and they pick up the pizza. It's a really easy transaction. We offer pizzas, we offer baked pasta, we offer salads. Um, it's a really fantastic way to reintroduce public to it. And we've been feeding our a little dough starter here since the day we closed on March 15th. And it's about time we fire it up and grow it. Absolutely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I would say I think pizza and fried chicken are like my my number one and number two yeah. for, for comfort food. But put them together. If yeah. Put them together. It's, it's even better. It's even better, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. Hey, now is there anything you wanted to whip up this morning too? Well, we we've just fired up the ovens and we don't open till three o'clock today, so not just yet. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, okay. I'm about so you got to you got to get all that cooking there. For a right now, yeah. I know the other thing you've been doing here on social media, uh, while some of your restaurants have been. Uh, closed down. I know you've been doing some of the um, Instagram live cooking classes. Mm -hmm. How's that going? You know, it's been going really well. It's keeping us connected to our customers, to our friends, to our family across the digital divide. Uh, it gives me an opportunity to do something fun and interesting. It gives us an opportunity to enjoy some of the Northwest ingredients. Uh, the, 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 the beautiful spring we're having now, and the only way we can share it is through visual media at this point. Uh, but today we're actually enjoying a little uh, dish that I'm going to be making with Dungeness crab, ricotta gnocchi, a little bit of uh, uh, preserved lemon. That's going to be the dish I'll demonstrate. It's a recipe for my book. Um, so I'm really excited to share that. It's been going really strong for the past six weeks we've been doing it uh, and people have been really enjoying it. Yeah. Uh, we also do a little uh, farmer box pickup. Uh, at Haley's Place, so we're, again, we're really supporting the local community and providing some really fantastic products that otherwise is not available to the public. So oh, that's every awesome. Saturday morning, yeah. Yeah, and, and as far as uh, what's available at the Crown, we talked about the, the fried chicken um, pizza that you guys have. Is it pretty much everything that's normally on the menu, or and only you're doing certain drinks pizzas? to go too, right? Right. The me the menu is definitely slightly amended. We okay. have some material favorites. We have the the pizzas. Uh, which include um, Imperial, which is the fried chicken pizza. Then we have the Captain Pepperoni. Uh, it's an ode to Sergeant Pepper, but we're doing a Captain Pepperoni there. Uh, we're going to do an Italian combo, margarita and then fresca, which are really nice pizzas. We've got some baked pastas, and we also offer something called a stimulus package. And that stimulus package actually is a nice family meal that can serve four to six people. So when people take it home with them, they can actually share it with the whole family. Uh, we've got some go. salad sandwiches, so it's really a nice, complete, uh, complete meal that they can create at home. Yeah, and then also some growlers too. You've also thought of drinks, which I, I appreciate. We have a lot of beers on tap, and we're we're able to share them uh, with the public. Uh, fantastic beers, yes, yeah. beer inside. Yeah. Now, Chef, how, how are you doing throughout all this? I know this has been really hard on our, our local restaurants and our, our restaurant community. Are you and your employees hanging in there? We're all hanging in there. We're doing the best we can. We're trying to stay positive. You know, I always say we can always bring people back to work, but we can't bring them back to life. I think it's important that we stay safe. We keep each other safe. We keep our employees safe. We keep our customers safe. And and there's there's no better way to say it. We'll open when we're when we're ready. When 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 we feel safe enough to open. When we have the process in place to make sure that the safety is ensured of everybody. Mm, Chef Vitaly Paley, some wise words right mm -hmm. there. Yeah. Well, so great to see you, and glad that you guys are able to do this. And if people are looking to order some of that takeout today, we will have more information on Coin.com. Chef Paley, thanks so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for having us. Yeah.